I think that today nearly all the patients are receiving lenalidomide in frontline therapy. And a lot of patients are relapsing either when they still receive lenalidomide or shortly after they have stopped receiving lenalidomide. So lenalidomide refractory patients are a patient population that is really increasing in number and we need novel therapies because like be shown in these posters, the, the likelihood of responding and, and a long-term response in, in a lenalidomide refractory patient is very low. So we need new treatments and that's the basis also for earlier treatment with bispecific antibodies and CAR T cells.